are super excited because it is finally fall and it is time to decorate pumpkins. But one of the bad parts about carving pumpkins is that once you carve it, they start to rot. Like, you know, they don't last as long when you carve it. And we still have two weeks or whatever until Halloween. And so we wanted to share four different ways that you can decorate pumpkins without carving it. And then we're gonna share three different ways that you can take care of your carved pumpkin to make sure that it lasts all the way through Halloween. And so we are really excited about this. What is your favorite? Um, the kid. This one was a little bit different because the stem is actually back the here. Tail. And this is actually the bottom. Because the nose is, that's actually the bottom of the nose. That's the bottom of the Cat. pumpkin. And then she has the tail that wraps around. I think the googly eyes are my favorite. It just really makes the pumpkins <laughs> <laughs> come to life and then this was something that we tried was this melted pumpkin and that was really fun and if you're a mom you know that you have a ton of you know broken crayons all over your house and so it's just like what's something fun that we can do with these crayons so we spent a couple minutes and we went through the whole house and we found every single broken crayon we could find and then all you do is you we had to use like stick glue to make sure that the crayon stayed in place because when we turned on the hair dryer, they kind of went and flew off. So we used that to kind of stick them on temporarily and then we used the hair dryer and it melted them. But that was super quick. It took probably less than 15 minutes total and it turned out really cute. And of course we put googly eyes on it because I mean, what's more fun than a pumpkin with googly eyes on it? And then Adeline was really excited about her little gourd that she turned into a bird. And so that's part of our little family here too. But I know that traditionally you want to carve your pumpkin. You want to have those memories. You want to get the pumpkin seeds out and maybe roast them. That's probably my favorite part of carving a pumpkin. But whenever you carve it, they start to rot. And then, you know, if we have, you know, two weeks left, they might not even make it until Halloween. So here are three different tips to help you keep your carved pumpkins lasting longer. And the number one tip is whenever you carve it, go ahead and bathe it in a solution of water and tea tree oil. Tea tree oil is an essential oil that has like antimicrobial, anti-fungus properties. So it will actually help kill everything that might be actually growing on the pumpkin but whenever you carve it you introduce the things from the outside into the inside and so that's actually one of the reasons why your pumpkin might be rotting and so that's a way you can soak it overnight so carve your pumpkin scoop out everything and then put it in a solution with like 40 drops or so of tea tree oil and that will help kill everything and then something that we learned last year is just that your pumpkin sitting out in the heat is one reason that kind of speeds up the rotting process because the heat actually kind of activates anything that might be growing on the pumpkin. And so we, if you bring your pumpkin in uh, and maybe refrigerate it during the night or refrigerate it whenever you, you don't need it outside, it will actually last longer. So it's almost like fresh flowers, you know? So bring your pumpkin in, maybe even just bring it inside when your house is, uh, you know, and this is a problem. I would say I'm from Louisiana. This is more of a problem in Louisiana probably than in Northern Arkansas, but whenever it's not cold yet and Halloween is still hot, then that, that's something that you can do is bring your pumpkin in, put it in the refrigerator and that will make it last longer. And then the last tip is you can make a spray solution and we actually did this last year where you do like one to two cups of water and then like 10 or 20 drops of tea tree oil and you keep it in a glass spray bottle. And every day we would go outside and we would spray the pumpkin, we'd take off the top, we'd spray it on the inside and we would just soak it. And that was a way to, we did do the bath, but that was a way to keep it from having everything growing on it during the two weeks or three weeks that your pumpkin's sitting outside and you're hoping that it's gonna make it through Halloween. And I know a lot of people put candles and stuff inside the pumpkin, but if you can only do that for special nights, like Halloween night, that will actually make it stay longer. Or you can use something like this that's not hot to put in your pumpkin because that heat is also gonna, it's just like the sun, that heat is gonna speed up the growth of the organisms and everything that actually make your pumpkin rot. But this is a little candle that looks like a fire. 
and you can probably get ones that are, are brighter and so they'll show up more, but that's a way that you cannot use fire inside your pumpkin and it will actually help it last longer. So I hope that these tips helped you guys. All the different tips to help your pumpkin stay fresh all season long through Halloween so that your, your guests are not spooked out by your rotting pumpkin on your porch, okay? So they can be spooked out by the way that your pumpkin looks, not the way that your pumpkin smells. So hopefully this helped you guys 